with the first pick in the 2017 NBA Draft, the Philadelphia 76ers select Markel Fultz from the University of Washington. And he can score at the rim. Great body balance by far in this draft, the best pick and roll ball handler in the, in the draft. Be acting like they really trapping. I ball like a maverick. My grandma be trapping. I got bitches from Miami to Dallas. That nigga talked down and got fixed like a pallet. All this hate shit got me charged like a tablet. My wrist it be whipping more bricks than the palace. I take your bitch on a date. I fuck your bitch in her face. My diamonds they drip like a lake. I sit back and thumb through this cake. Sleep on me, that's your mistake. Bitch, I make hits like I'm Drake. Like I'm Drizzy, I run through my city. City name Houston. Like so what is good, YouTube? It's your boy Legendary E, and we back. We back here for that video. We back here for that Markel Fultz, my career. And I did go ahead and put the boy on the 76ers. I was waiting for this man to get drafted. And here he is, number one overall pick. And yo, that's one of the main reasons I did take a while to upload this episode. I like, like, yo. At this point, I feel like I feel like I'm lying to you guys, but yo, this time I'm dead ass. I will start being a lot more active with this series, you guys. Since the NBA draft is over, I want to see what I can do with Kel. I like I told you guys before, him and De'Aaron Fox are probably my favorite rookies uh, in this year's draft class. But I feel like there are so many players with star power. So let me know in the comment section below. Will Markel become a superstar? Can he become a superstar? And how is this team looking like? I mean, they got they got Ben Simmons and Bead, Sarik. Fultz, we got hella players on this team. We got hella players on this team, and I can't wait to see what we're gonna do. Now, the one question I have: Are they gonna start Covington or are they gonna start Luau? Because I feel like in that picture, it was kind of an indication that they might go Covington. But anything that they do really, really makes sense to me in the first place. But let's start. Let's try this out. All right, the Blue's probably gonna get the most minutes. Uh, some your way. Covington can play that much minutes. Okay, uh, hold on. All right, let's do that. Let's try out this lineup and let's see what we can do. Uh, for this episode, we got Markel Fultz, Covington, Ben Simmons, Sark, and Embiid. I think this is going to be awesome. We are led by Brett Brown. I can't wait to play that Markel is on the 76. Just let me know how you guys feel about the NBA draft. I did go ahead and live stream it, and my reactions were freaking litty. Like, I thought that was one of the best drafts in a really, really long time. And as we know, the Bulls went rebuild mode. All the all the rosters are updated. Uh, you know, the the Wolves. Nasty ass team. But anyways, let's get straight into it. And if you guys want to see another episode, make sure to go ahead and get 400 likes for I know that you guys can do. You guys have you guys have hit like 500 on every single one of them. So please make sure you go ahead and do that. Follow your boy on Twitter and subscribe if you guys are new. And let's see if we can dub these Bulls. I mean. For real, for real, they ain't got nobody too crazy on that roster. Yo, 2K, nobody is buying VC. Stop it. Stop it. But let's get straight into that gameplay. It's Markel's NBA debut. I know that we already did that in the last one. But I'm doing it with the Philadelphia 76ers. I think they definitely took a W in the NBA draft. Yes, they gave up another pick for him. But I think that he might have been actually... I know he's worth it. I think that he has the work ethic. People question him winning. Uh, the same way that they question Ben Sims. But, yo, talent is talent. And I think that these guys got it. I think that they got it. And, yo, I think that we're going to blow out the Chicago Bulls. I'm not going to lie. I think that we're going to blow these guys out. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Like I said, like up the video. Subscribe. Do all that good stuff. And I think that we're going to hand them a W. They did. Like, apparently, they picked up Rudy Gay for agency. Uh, because I did just sim through free agency. We got Markel Fultz. He signed with Nike. Let let me know if you guys are ready for that Lonzo Markel rivalry. I will be showcasing it in this series along with some of the other prospects. Ben Simmons knocked that hoe down. It's gonna be a brick because he can't shoot, bro. That surprisingly almost went in though. All right, come on. Nope, come on. Oh, give me that one, boy. Give me that one. Anybody cutting? I see you, Ben. Oh, Ben, Ben, calm down, Ben. Ben, stop. Oh, Ben, that was a deep two. I see you, boy. Let's get buckets. Let's get straight buckets. Come on, Kel. I want to see what Markel can do. And I do want to see what others can do. All right. Hit, hitting up Joel Embiid. I'm cutting. Hit me up. 
and we get our first points in the NBA. I wanted it to be a little bit more flashy, but nonetheless, an, a quick, easy bucket. All right, so right now we are up 4-2. to two. I am trying to, to make this series a little, a little bit more realistic. Like, I know that the last time I was getting like 50 points, like, in my debut, I got like 30 points, and that's not happening in real life at all. So, I think I can go ahead and cop like 15 to 20. Let's see. Good defense. All right, Jerry and Grant. Why couldn't they just play Zach at point guard? I know what. I'm not going to help them, but... And they, they just got Chris done. They, they would not be rocking with Jerry and Grant. Right here. Thank you for that board. Let's go. Who with me? Oh, give me that one. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. I see you, Kel, getting freaky with that dunk. Let's hope that we can keep this thing alive. Like I said, I don't want to go out here and get like 25 points, 30 points in my debut. I do want to keep this somewhat realistic if possible. So I will be passing it a lot more. Because obviously Ben Simmons and Embiid will want to get buckets of their own. Right here. I see you. Just shoot. Just shoot. Just shoot it. Bro. Ben Simmons is knocking down threes out here. It's on Hall of Fame. What's his three? It has to be like, like a 30, but he's... It's an F. And he's knocking them things down. Open is a, okay. I don't know how he made that, but Ben Simmons, I see you. Come on, clamp up. Jerry and Grant, I'm not really all, all that afraid. Give me that. <laughs> look at that block. Look, look at that block. Jerry and Grant ain't know what was going on. What's he doing? Get that up out of here, coach. Let's go. All right. Oh, go up, go up, go up. Bro, I, I thought that was going to be an automatic steal. I swear I did, but we are cooking these guys. They only have two points in the first quarter. Bro. Yo. Gar Pax and Fred Ho and Fred Hoiberg. How are y'all not fired right now? Y'all have even scored four points. Oh, I see you, Sarge. Go up. Ooh. Four assists. That's how we gonna do it. We gonna pass first and score later. Because, like, Kale is a good passer. I know that normally in real life he scores a lot more. But, yo, if we got teammates, we're trying to win. End of the first quarter. It's 18-2. to two. Yeah. Sorry, Chicago fans. Come on. Oh, Cameron Payne got me with that weak-ass move. He still can't get buckets, though. He, <laughs> he really still can't get buckets, though. Jaleel, keep going. Go. Man, you're not getting it, man. Jaleel, oh, go up. That's all you. Let's go. Four points, five assists. All right, now, I think now I'm going to start scoring more. I'm trying to get a three-pointer, but I'm going to need a screen. Give me that. Let's go. That's all you, Kel. Bruh, we can't knock down a shot to save our life. All right, we, <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but we need to start scoring right, right now. Like, right now. Granted, they've only scored seven points, but still. I see you. Go up. Go up, let's go. Six assists. So, right now, I'm doing really, really well when it comes to passing. I shouldn't get my scoring up because I only have four points. Damn. I can't really guard him. Oh, right there. Oh, let's go. Wide open lane. All right, y'all. It's time for the second half. They only dropped 15 points in that first half. We got 34. Let's see if Kel can have a better, like, can, can have... A bigger impact in the scoring department and when if we can chill out with the fouls geez all the way oh oh my bro 2k hates me 2k hates me hold hold the front door how sway how bruh bruh what now this game got to be trolling now it has to be trolling just it, it just has to be all right, you know what? Let's get back to passing. This is unacceptable. Kale, knock it down. <laughs> okay, yeah. Uh, let's let's just keep passing because we are cold as ice. Come on, trash pain. Come on, pain. Show me some. Show me some. Damn, I could have had that one. No, look at that block. Okay, Kale. Okay, Kale. I see you. 
That man smacked that. He smacked that back to Sacramento. Hell no. Nah. Actually, back to Memphis. There you go. Go up. Good stuff. Right here. All the way. Oh. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Now, I could easily go out here and drop 30, but it's not It's not even fun because then y'all to see me beasting like it's more fun to like pass the ball and not to work through a system because at least then the videos can be a lot more entertaining. Oh, Ben Simmons, knock it down. Just shoot it. Just shoot it. Bro, what, what, what is Ben Simmons on, bro? Ben Simmons took that secret stuff. He's knocking down. He's stupid. He, he hit two three-pointers, y'all. Two threes. My settings, nothing's changed. He's knocking down them threes. All right, as far as stats go, though, we are here balling. 12, 2, and 10. Embiid is doing his thing. Simmons, I'm liking what I'm seeing. Deadass. I'm liking it. We're, we're about 32, which makes sense. This team isn't that good. Trash campaign. I see you, Embiid. That court vision. This is a good, realistic debut it's nothing too crazy y'all it's actually believable and in the end y'all already know we came away with, with, with the victory we win 71 to 43 we pretty much cooked them brett brown shouts out to you big fella we went out there and we balled let's see if markel was playing the game and i'm pretty sure he was 2k with its self promo yo 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 always plug head ass nobody's buying vc anymore the game is pretty much dead it really is, but player of the game is my boy Fultz. 12 points, 2 rebounds, and 11 assists. I didn't want to keep this realistic. I easily could have got 30 points. It's not really that hard, but I decided to get my teammates involved. And, and a triple-double isn't really realistic, so I think that this was the funnest way for the gameplay to go. And it made it a lot more enjoyable to play because normally when I play, I go out there and beast and feast and... After a while, it gets boring, but this one was genuinely fun. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys did, make sure to go ahead and leave a like on the video. Smash the like button and subscribe if you guys want to see more of this series. Dario Sark was our leading scorer. Uh, 14 points for him. You guys already know my stats. I shot 0 for 4 from the 3, so we need to work on that 3-point shot a lot more. It was not falling, or maybe I need to get down his release. And beat with 11 and 7. Simmons with only one assist, which kind of shocks me, but I know I was kind of running more point guard for them. Lowry marking in 12 points, and yeah, he was he was solid. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you guys did, make sure to go ahead and smash that like button. Markel balled out in his NBA debut, but until next time, y'all, it's your boy Legendary EA, and I will catch you guys in the next video. But until then, I'm out. Peace, y'all. Congratulations Worked so hard, forgot how to vacation